I thought it's my son. He'll always be my son. You can't help how you feel, Martin. You're, you're gonna feel differently about this one. Oh, so, so I don't get a say in this at all, no? Here, look. Here you go. That's the defib. That's the sleeping mat. How did you even pay for that? You don't have the money from Kush it yet. Don't matter. I shouldn't have gone and spoke to Kush. Without your butt. Stace, he is my son. He has got Kush and he has got me. Same with Lily. I'm their dad, all right? End of argument. So can we just stop all this? Right? This is stupid. And just go back to the way we were. I don't know. Well, it's up to you, Stace, because everyone else is up for it. Look, we are family, whether you like it or not. We're stuck with each other. Look, I love you all just the same. I need to check on Arthur. Look, and when this one comes, I will love him or her too. Just don't ever think different. I don't want to argue. Look, I have been worried about Arthur ever since you told me. And maybe I didn't tell you that because I didn't want to worry you anymore. Because I wanted to be strong. OK, I believe you. I'm sorry I doubted you about taking your meds. I just said I don't want to argue, Martin. Well, I'm on your side, Stace. So why doesn't it feel like it? Are you tired? Exhausted? And you're clearly worrying. Oh, don't make this about me. You know, when you, you told me about the bipolar, I told you it made no difference. And we said whatever happened, we'd get through it. If we talked about it, yeah, together. So why didn't you just ask? Because... Because I'm not perfect, am I? I get things wrong. And, you know, when I did try to talk to you about it earlier, about Arthur and everything... You bit your head off. Yeah. Well... You haven't had the chance for a while, have you? <laughs> Every step last time... I was there. You know, when you thought everyone was against you, I was there. Up on that roof, shutting at the stars, I was there. In that hospital, you know, watching you in, in so much pain. And knowing that in there somewhere was the Stacey that I loved. I know. Right, well, I'm... I was there then and I'm here now. I believe in you. I've never, ever stopped believing in you. Feels like feels like everyone's judging me and, and questioning my every move. Not me. But sometimes I even question myself, Martin. You know, I said that nothing would make me prouder than to call you Mrs. Stacy Fowler. And I meant it. For better, for worse. And we've had both of me. <laughs> For richer, that would be nice, yeah. <laughs> For poorer, well, we can do that. In sickness and in health. Well, sickness is our special subject, so <laughs> when we get to health, we'll coast it. I'm not saying that I'm never going to mess up again. Of course I will. You might even make the tiny mistake yourself occasionally. But whatever gets thrown at us. Kush, Arthur, come on. We can get through anything. I love you, Stacey Fowler. I'm on your side.